about like the like I can see some of my clients who with their riding they get on and it's like I could just tip them out of the saddle like that. correct like just they're well, that's, so, the, well, that's so when you just nicely get them into this the saddle right and they're uh -huh. sitting here like this and you go now lightly press in to the left stirrup okay okay and let go press into the right stirrup and let go and now, as you press into the left stirrup, look to the right. Cool. And come back. And now press into the right stirrup and look to the left. Huh, that's so funny. But now they know where their bodies are. They, their counterbalance is good. They've synchronized their bodies. And they don't even know that they did anything. Cool. But if all of a sudden the horse goes to do something, they're going to be quicker to do this yeah. than go that. Yeah. Awesome. So I teach that with golf pros all the time. They come to me and like, I said, just sit there before the guy goes out golfing. But that's a golf swing. So, so is that a writing therapy? Well, writing people can do a hippotherapy. But, but again, if you can look at any person and make them successful before they start, yeah. They're going to think, wow, I was with this girl. She was great. She was amazing. I felt so good on the horse. All she did with this, she'll look like a, such a better instructor yeah. because she made familiarize them with the horse without yeah. saying, yeah. they don't care what, way. they don't care that this is a bridle. They don't care that this is a holster. They don't care that that's stir, you know what I mean? They just don't want to know where they are in space. Yeah. That's all anybody wants to yeah. do. When you're autistic, you don't know where you are in space. And when, when you're in CP, space is the last thing on your mind. So for hippotherapy, the movement from the hippo, the horse, transfer to the... Basically what I'm doing for you yeah. is a hippotherapy. Yeah. I've done everything to your pelvis a horse is going to yeah. do. But if you don't have me, a horse allows your legs to be separate for your pelvis to move around it. It brings yeah. back that gyroscope yeah. function. Yeah. That being said, if your kid's like this on a yeah. horse, screaming, yeah. Maybe not a great learning curve. Yeah. My kid would hate just the smell of the horse, where the other one I think would be okay with. You know what I mean? Like so, yeah. sometimes, you know, you're better off yeah. on a, a smaller animal, or yeah. or or again, putting him on a situation like I'm doing and yeah. allowing it to happen, and then going to there.